it should respond by not responding in nuclear terms. So it should take a nuclear rhetoric out of the conversation to the extent possible. It should not play Russian game of nuclear threats. There are several kind of possible scenarios that have been considered. One is the, a battlefield use of nuclear weapons, of a low yield nuclear weapon against a mil military target. Uh, generally, it is viewed that there's not that many military targets on the Ukrainian side that could present, uh, as it were, fitting an attractive target. Another possible uh, use scenario would be um, against the city, more of a political use. Both scenarios are terrible. Both scenarios um, will break the taboo against nuclear use that has held for over seven decades. Um, none of them are very highly likely, but they're still too close to comfort, and we should be thinking about how to prevent those very, very hard. We ought to be a lot more relaxed about it. Not because nuclear weapons are not serious, but because actually, look, there's no real signs that, that Russia has at all any intent of actually using nuclear weapons. It would make no sense to use tactical nuclear weapons on the Ukrainian battlefield, and in any case, begins to court Armageddon. Instead, this is an information operation. The Russians know perfectly well that every time Putin hints about nuclear use or some academic goes on television to say that there should be a first strike on Europe, there are going to be people in the West who get scared and who therefore start to say, no, we need to make some kind of a deal. We need to pressurize Kyiv to make some kind of an ugly deal with Russia. The most effective way to deter Russia from using nuclear weapons in Ukraine is for Ukraine's partners and allies to really stay together and keep their solidarity and their unity around the support of Ukraine's conventional war effort. It is um, this kind of Russia's sensing of Western divisions and Western weaknesses, as it were, that could be a permissive factor for, for Russia to, to take that really drastic step.